Okie dokie. Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. Hello, good morning. It's an hour later than usual, but it, it was necessary. Still really sleepy. But that's okay, because we can finish Grand Theft 3 today and then never have to think about it again. Now, in the future, if I have the urge to play it, I can just watch this archive. We called it a day. Um, shoo. Alright, so I do have a save file already, where I'm at in front of the end boss with like, I think, two or three extra hours of grinding. Uh, which is mostly uh, lucky hairs. You played longer yesterday, so you're allowed to start later. Actually, I just slept in. <laughs> when I woke up, it was like quarter after seven, and I was like, oh, I usually start to stream at seven, but uh... So I just made it eight o'clock instead. But yeah, uh, so I'm gonna just hoof it through all of this nonsense. Oh, there goes my charger. Just gonna bypass all of this. I don't... No, I think Ulf's weapon was in this... Oh, that's a dead end. It's awkward. Uh, but yeah, most of the grinding that you're gonna do is... Uh, finding the one spawn that has the lucky hair. Which is, uh... Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, that's magic. That might be craze. That's definitely craze. And that is good. Okay, yeah, we'll, just, we'll just run. Uh, it's finding the lucky here. There's one minotaur I can point it out later. That spawns with three of them. And uh, immediately what you do is... You just hit the uh, freeze time button. Like, you use the orb. And then you just crush the... Uh, the rabbits into dust. It's really uninteresting, but uh, I posted a picture on Twitter yesterday. I think I got like some 50,000 experience points, which was I think two or three level ups each. It's awesome. I think this is Ulf's web. Oh no, actually, I think that's further ahead. Oh yeah, no, never mind. Whoop. Yeah, it's not. There's one more boss in the next map. That's Ulf's weapon. It's actually out in the open. It's not even in the treasure chest, it's just like laying there. You're surrounded by one? This is nuts. Pick a card. Any card. And I still don't have <laughs> the, the Grandia ability, a uh, Dragon Slash. Which is... I've been grinding... S yeah, again, like, th three-ish hours, and it's, Yuki just can't learn it. He has to hit, like, a special level 9, which he isn't. It's like, oh, does he use, like, special attacks and crits and shit? And he just, he just won't. He just won't learn it. Why are you like this, Yuki? Why won't your special level increase anymore? What happened, my dude? Da -da 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 -da. We'll just run by all the nonsense. Oh yeah, remember this map because you'll never see it again. Like this area, yeah, but this particular layout of the map is gonna uh, be gone. Oh, Mega Vulcan! Whoops, didn't see that. Be gone, Moon. There's monsters on the moon, imagine that. Never catch us now. Is, it, is it night night moon? I don't remember. It might be night night moon. Reduce the special move SP. Perfect. Oh yeah, Ulf also didn't learn his ultimate ability, dynamite rush. So I'll just go into the final boss without Dragon Slash or Dynamite Rush, which is fine. <laughs> they're all, uh, they're AoE attacks. Although Dynamite Rush does, I think, like, six hits over, like, an area of effect. 
is really good. I don't remember if Dragon Slash is just like one hit or multiple hits, but it's also an AoE attack. So it's whatever. Yuki does this shit for damage anyway. I don't know why he's so garbage. Oh wait, look look away for a quick second. While I save my game. Okay, and we're back. Now hope I don't die. Although when I did this boss uh, yesterday, I had the luckiest run of my life. Um, I won't say it, I'll see if it happens again. I doubt it will, but it'd be really funny if it does. Oh shit, I don't even know. Does she have enough SP? This might be problematic. Oh yeah, okay, it's fine. Immediately Rock Breaker. Skewer, Wheel Slice, a Mega Ball. This might sting. A little. This might sting. Okay, so this is the exact same boss as the one previous, except for everything has double the health. The rest is the same. It's fucking annoying because everything's so strong now. <laughs> I think that's multiply. Wait a minute. Oh, she learned it. Armageddon. So Armageddon hits everything on the battlefield and reduces the attack, defense, and speed of every enemy. It's really good. So it's really expensive. <laughs> Offense down, defense down, speed down. Hell yeah. Want to see you run around the battlefield now with your nonsense. Just in case we'll dig in. I don't know what's going to happen. Uh... Oh shit, I didn't switch the spells around this file. Whoopsies. Well, whatever. Haven't skated is. This should protect you. With their attack down and my defense up? No problem. Nice multiply. How'd that work out? Oh, I didn't switch my Steam title, a, st a stream title, so it's still number 9, it's actually number 10. And I don't want to jinx it and call him the finale, because I don't know if the end boss is going to mess me up. But we'll find out together. Grandia 10? Imagine that. Yeah, yeah, that's the one that... Like, originally, the plot was kind of, like, weird, but people are warming up to it now, but at least the music's great. The protagonist was whack, man. Whack. Uh, still hit a good area. They also made Grandia 10 too. Spin-off series featuring uh, Alfina and Hecht. It was weird. Then they had like an OC in the party. Okay, Omega Ball don't care, Wheel Slice, that might be bad. There's a lot of people attacking Donna. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's craze. I think I can cancel Wheel Slice sometimes, so that's not a big deal. Oh shit, absolute zero. Might be better. Like, Heaven's Gate is great, but uh... Wait a minute. Like how the game knows that it's gonna be instant. Crimson Shock is uh, the same cancel attack, but it's an AoE, which is amazing. And also, uh, her ability, uh, one of the skills she has equipped is her magic can cancel also. So if I ever get around to casting uh, Crackle Fang, it'll just cancel everything on the field. AoE cancel? Whack. It's so good. 
But yeah, uh, Armageddon is like the real. Wow, that's the good shit. Which I actually have to recast. <laughs> nice little Mega Bond on that. Do we still have Astera Zap? I do. Probably should have looked at that first. Never mind, it's done, it's fine. Oh, it's done again, oh no. I was like, it's done again. <laughs> How about now that they are spinning around? I wonder if he hit like the limit of how many enemies he can have. Uh, it's, it's not gonna hit everything, so I'm not gonna bother. I always read Omega Bread, I don't know why, but it's Omega Bread. That should hopefully nuke one or two of them. It did no such thing. Oh, uh, so boink. Stop it. Oh, not hacked. She's baby. Oh shit. Yeah, that's not good. Whoa. Uh -oh. Yeah, oh, 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 oh. This is going bad really fast. We'll slice an Ulf. He'll he'll live. He'll be fine. Oh wait, not resurrect. Uh, resurrect potion. Miracle. Yeah, he'll be fine. See. Don't worry. I still have my trump card. Hello. Yuki's in trouble. What if we Armageddon for free? Okay, that's what happened yesterday too. I got like two free Armageddons. And then the third one I actually paid for, but it was three 300 damage attacks. Or SP, I mean. Something posing the ground. Mom says it's my turn to T pose. Can't attack Ulf if you're dead. It did not die. That was problematic. Oh no, never mind, it's fine. And then we pop a healing gem. Time to recover. And all better, look at that. All the boo-boos are gone gone. Okay, Meteor Strike's not a terrible option. It could be worse. Could be Crackle Fang. Or di Diamond Dust, I think it knows. <laughs> Yuki tanking a meteor to the face. Uh, Blade Star? That's actually overkill. Yeah. Shit, that was overkill. Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. Is that thing moving yet? Oh yeah, okay. Oh yeah, uh, she learned it earlier, but Mana Spring makes every cast take 0 MP. It's really good, but it's not worth it right now, because it's pretty much over. And for the end boss, it's sometimes okay. Like, you can pop it, and then, you know, get all your... 
your spells out for free, but if she dies, it gets cancelled anyway, and she might <laughs> die pretty fucking fast. Because the end boss has a, uh, quite a lot of nasty attacks. So it's like spent a turn turning out one for free, or just blast away anyway and then chuck a potion later. It's like, eh. Let's do another Armageddon. Let's just keep going. Let's just go, bro. Wait, is Yuki gonna die? We'll take that risk. If that one random enemy like attacks Yuki, yeah, you might be dead. Oh, it does fine. I'm not too worried about it. He's already like five levels ahead anyway. Wow. One last Omega Ball. You can also get those big. What are they called? Gammas, I think. No. Um. Deltas? Like the, the... Yeah, yeah, those guys. <laughs> exactly those ones. I was like, he hasn't sounded any yet, that's weird. Yeah, exactly those ones. Precisely. <laughs> All right, that was the second last boss. Look at that. If you destroy that nucleus, you can clear the sky of Zorn's roots, every one of them. Let's take the thing out with a bang. Like, with a... Yeah, that was the second to last boss. The next boss is the final boss of the game. It's nothing in between us and the big bad man. Well, unless you count like the, I, I, whoopsies, like six cutscenes or something. That might be bossish. Yeah, exactly. Grandia 1 and 2, for both games, um, everything leading up to the boss is pretty hard. Like, I remember the second to last boss in Grandia 1, uh, which has like f four or five body parts. That guy's hard. And then you get to the final boss with like the, the big dude with the two ads. We're going to be very specific about it. But, you know, the big dude with the two ads that spawn more ads. Pretty easy. Pretty easy, and then like the second phase, even stupid, more stupid easy. Uh, Grandia 2 has, I think, four bosses before the final boss, give or take. Maybe three, doesn't matter. And uh, that's pretty... I don't remember it being hard, but it's also been a while since I've done that. And then the final boss is a joke, just like Grandia 1. So in this game, it's the other way around, where uh, Emilius aside... And the Merc Crystal boss is really hard, and Emilius was relatively hard, but I was prepared for it at least. And now everything other than that is a joke, and then the final boss is actually kind of difficult. I can see well from here. The sky in your world, it must be beautiful. Wait, where are we? Oh, I've worried about Athena. Where the... Seriously, where are we then? This is not our world, are we actually on the moon? Ah, Endwalker, finally. But yeah, I like the Grandia 2 boss rush at the end. It's just like boss, 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 boss. The 
there may still be time left. Hmm? Hmm? Is someone up there? <laughs> Alfina! <laughs> Alfina, you were chained up? Question mark. What you doing there? Do 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 do. Oh yeah. Let's just hoof it through this dungeon. Back this way. I mean, we won't go this way. Alright, oh, there's a treasure chest. Uh, yoink. Oh shit, maybe we'll go that way. Just kidding. That was a joke. Oh. Nice. Treasure. What's in here? Enemy. 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 No treasures? Nope. Perfect. So I'll ignore that. The big one. The ancient one. The biggest boomer. Uh. Ah. Small chance of cancelling all damage from attack. Ooh, small chance. So you're telling me there's a chance. Oh, those are the flying satans. From Grandia 2, the Casper Boob. Gan Gandalf? Oh, Grandalf with an R. I do like in uh <laughs> again talking about Grandia one and two. In Grandia one and two when the hero gets like the, the ultimate sword. Uh it's like a cutscene and it's a big deal, like with Justin when he gets the spirit sword. It leads up to it really nicely, and Ryudo when he gets the spoiler sword. Uh I think he actually you have to go for like some trials to like get it at the end. It's really cool, and <laughs> with Yuki, it's just, Grand Elf is just in a treasure chest, unceremoniously. It's just there. Outside of the Gambler, which is technically the best sword, but it's also the worst sword. But I don't wanna, I don't wanna gamble that. Zero interest in playing cards, or d dice, r rather. Wait, what? Oh. Yoink. Yep, just the door. Okay. Alright, Minotaur. Come here. Just kidding, don't come here, please. Thank you. Very nice. Very polite. Not bad. What? If you're walking at the ground collapsed... Oop. Congratulations, Aemilius. Zorn will be reborn at last. That 
means the world of our hopes and dreams will soon be upon us. And you will be rewarded for all of your suffering. Yes. Zorn and I are alike. We are both still incomplete. But uh, <clears throat> very soon you will make us both complete. At last, Zorn and I will finally be as one, like I always wanted. You know, I was wondering the same thing, it's like, why even bother with the 20 foot rope <laughs> if you're just gonna, like, cut her loose? What have I done? This <laughs> is so stupid. Wait, I'm confused. At last, the ultimate power, Zorn has been reborn! Okay, so, first of all, what happened to the giant evil snake? I feel like that's, uh... That might be more important to the plot, because that fucker could probably eat the entire world by himself. Uh, Pencil Eyebrows was uh, Emilius' teacher back at the temple. And that's all we learned about him in the entire game. It's just, he was Emilius' teacher. It's probably another one of those things that was just rushed and cut to meet a deadline at the end. Because, uh, him... And the dude with the dragon, they're just there. They don't add anything, they're just obstacles. And Pencil Eyebrows isn't even a fucking obstacle. He's actually just like, hanging out. Uh, I don't care. But yeah, like every time you're on like the giant flying snake, the Pencil Eyebrows was there. Like he was just present. 
Uh, he's talked like in one or two cutscenes when Emilius was talking to like the mirror. Uh, but yeah, and that's just I think you only hear about that like in the library or like one of the NPCs was talking about it like, oh Emilius vanished and so did like one of his the dudes that was like teaching him the whatever sacred arts or nonsense some nonsense. I don't actually think he shows up again. There's still like two cutscenes left, actually I don't need to save, it's fine. It's just a plot hole as big as that flying, world devouring snake. Wait, so we lost the snake and stabbed Cocoon and gained a red floating orb and pencil eyebrows. Feels kind of a naked downgrade. <laughs> yeah, the snake would have been so cool. Even though, as a boss fight, I feel like it would be disappointing because all you have to do is probably like bash its skull in repeatedly. Oh yeah, there's like a ton of treasure chests in this area, but uh, I picked them all up in like the save file where I was grinding, so I'm not gonna bother. <laughs> oh no, he's still relevant. You have my thanks, Emilius. You were essential to my plan. However, things weren't quite as simple as you might have thought they were. Nice pause. Funny how life can be like that. Hmm. <laughs> Zorn, the Magnificent! No one will be able to stand in my way now. <laughs> That's ugly as shit. The world shall be mine, now and forevermore! Or... Zorn, fill me with your divine power! So how come this kills literally everybody except for Emilius who also got stabbed through the skull? Unless it's some weird guardian power, I don't care. The NPC I forgot about betrayed him. <laughs> No, I'm guessing Zorn didn't kill Emilius because he had half of the Guardian Seal on his hand that Zorn needed to get revived the second. Now that I think about it, that makes more sense. Because it's like, if I kill the dude with the seal, then uh, I'll never become alive. And that's problematic. Whoops. But yeah. We were just talking about how this guy appears so little, and that's yeah, that's the end of his character. Why? Why? I don't care. I don't know. It's, it's not I've never explored. I give a shit. Cry, cry, cry. It's all you're ever good for. Cry, cry, cry. You, with a guardian orb, you can't even kill a world devouring snake. I'm, I'm, I'm sad we lost the snake though, that would have been cool. Like some Dalamander bullshit. This might sting a little. 
Boy, 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 row, 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 row. Why are you blocking our path? Why are you? Why are you in the way? I suppose this is a sort of victory. There we go. That's better. The snake should have been able to be a vessel for Zorn. Yeah, but then the end boss wouldn't be a giant evil butterfly. It would be a giant evil snake, and that's not very grandia like. We gotta have the evil butterfly at the end. Then the end boss has to be a butterfly. Exactly, exactly. Uh, I still won't save. Alright. Finale time. Ta tamale time? Tamale time. Emilia, what the fuck, dude? It is the beginning of the end. I will never rest as long as love continues to exist. Love is the cause of all. <laughs> All conflict, it must be wiped from the face of this world, now and for all eternity. No! Only when all who love have been destroyed will Why is he talking like that? Is he like... Is he, he's really pushing it. He's struggling to speak. Might be the lack of mouth. What's with the camera angle? Wait, the beginning of the end was the start of disc 3. Is that Final Fantasy 7 reference? So what's the plan? <gasps> Giant snake! The snake is back! Okay, but what's the story with the snake? It's just that it's just there. <laughs> oh yeah, that'll do that'll do damage. He's gone. To put an end to this. To protect something important to him. The bond between you. The snake is Emilius? I don't think. <clears throat> that would be way too interesting. <laughs> nah, that'd be too good of a twist. But then also doesn't explain how Emilius was riding like on top of the snake. Unless he's part snake. I'll create a bridge for you. Get to Zorn at once. Oh, 
Oh yeah, no, Zorn just chills, and you can fuck off and grind and do whatever you want. You can go gambling. Zorn will wait for you. He's in no rush. He's baby. We're going to... Die. I entrust all of my belongings to you, Alfina. I hope you'll find them useful. Although we'll be parting, I'll be with you in spirit. Wait, what do you mean we're parting? I can send you back to the plane. No, I'm okay. Where would you even go? Anywhere. Anywhere you want. Just for fun. Just for giggles. Uh, I think... And like, when I played this originally, like years ago, I went back to the desert a couple times just to make more mana eggs and stuff like that. Alright, let's load my save file where I finished grinding. I'm only four levels ahead. Oh, and I actually have to do some random battles because I think my orb is empty, so we have to do a couple of random encounters. Oh yeah, okay, well let's set this way because I know there's like some baby enemies right there. And then we'll finish this game. It hasn't even been an hour yet, so yeah, I guess this pads out the rest of the stream a little bit. But yeah, she can send you back to the plane, and then from the plane, you can just go wherever you want. It's funny how, like, the the sky and, like, the nucleus and everything was just, like, in the middle of the field randomly. It's great. Oh, actually, my orb is not empty, empty. But yeah, I might need it for Zorn. I'll, I'll definitely need it for Zorn. For some, uh, clutch. I'll just go nuts. Yeah, <laughs> Heck doesn't really stick around. He's only here for, like, this part of the game. You can really, you can patter out. And, you know, do, like, side stuff. Like, just go grinding, whatever. But I don't know if, like, the experience she gains, I don't know if it carries over to Alfina. It's, I could Google search it, but I was just like, ah, we'll just, we'll just help it. And then when Alfina joined, that's when I went to chase down the rabbits. Hey, if Yuki gets, like, Dragon Slash before Zorn, that'd be fantastic. I'm not counting on it, though. Normal attack. Something, something. Oh, we'll just keep having Skate. Let's keep going. It worked the last time. The banks won't fail because they're not designed to. Hiya! This final card Hopefully this kills it. It should do 6,500. So yeah, any questions about the plot that I may or may not be able to answer while we're just uh, hitting things? Oh, nice. Sweet insta key. Of course. And she's got it. I won't hold back. Oh no, Omega dude, you're too fast. Never mind, you're fine. Do we have like regular crackle? No, but I have burn strike. Burn strike. Burn strike. Nice. The fates have smiled on us today. Let's 
that's the same fight. That's the exact same fight. Uh, that one's attacking Yuki, perfect. Ooh, that's slow. Oof, that's rough, buddy. Galactic Bang. Uh, actually, a Ripple Shot might be. Might be Overkill. Let's just stun force the big guy. I won't hold back. Stop it. You're getting a bit too hot under the collar. Absolute zero costs 99 for Yugi because I don't have water mastery on him. And I won't start now. Is that guy still casting craze? Go nuts, buddy. Cancel. This will be more than a little frostbite. Wah, 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 wah. Pa, 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 pa. <laughs> one, one, zero, zero. <laughs> nice. I'm just trying to refill his pee. Don't mind me. Please don't hurt me. I love the cheerful battle music at the end of the world. Same. Morgenstern? Well, that's not good. Some say that's bad. Oh, wait, I have. Skill level? Wait, oh, I kind of skipped through that. No, I think I need special level 9, not skill level 9, to get his final ability. Uh, restores SP when hit. No, that's not it. Restores SP at intervals, that's the one, okay. I just have to remember to switch it back later, because Zorn does uh, a move that I think casts every status effect in you. It's like bad breath. Uh, so I need to have like immunity for that. Unless he doesn't, and I'm misremembering things. But pretty sure. Alright, let's get those SP. I won't hold back. <laughs> I didn't even break a sweat. Alright, let's keep going. Should be like five, five, six encounters, and I know there's a uh, the labyrinth earlier with like that many uh, like ramps going up and down. There's like a bunch of like easy enemies there, so I just crush those. Hopefully that's enough. I hope. Oh, that minotaur! I think there's only like one, so I can crush the minotaur. Do 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 Two snakes. Snack. Wheel slice. Well, that's not good. This might sting a little. Man, if only wheel slice did like as much damage. Oh no, not wheel slice. Uh. I forget. Feel the bite of my 700, Yuki. Let's step it up, my dude.
Oh, that might not kill actually, but crack? Oh no, wait, the resist, the resistant, right? Am I crazy? Might be crazy. Yep, sure are. But they're not resistant to Heaven's Gate. Shit, that's B. Hold me, I was A. I wasn't looking. Bum, 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 bum. Shit. Uh, whatever. Boink. Ha, ah, 420. Oh, healing gem. Perfect. Oh, there was a Minotaur here, but I guess they don't respawn until you, like, take the plane and leave completely. I'll keep those two in mind. Eh, yeah, let's keep going. Oh, yeah. Oh, two of them. That might present an issue. Yeah. Oh, never mind. They're pretty squishy. Lotus. Please be good, please be good. Ooh, really good, real good. Then, oh, never mind. Wait, burn strike? No. Crackle Fang should kill it. Never mind, that wasn't so bad. There's one battle though. I had like three, three or four of them. And I was like, okay, no, 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 no. Nice, magic level up too. That's amazing. That actually gave a lot of experience points. That's not bad at all. Let's see, get some more levels in. I'm trying to find information about the snake online and coming up empty. Yeah, that's definitely cutting room floor stuff. It's just, just forget about it. It's not real, it can't hurt you. Pick a card, any card. Right, Dafina, what do we have? I don't have any AoE attacks on her. That's, uh... That's on me. That's bad planning. do this. Useless though. This might sting a little. Feel the bite of my And now we wait. We wait for the proper turn order. Normal attack. Casting something. Casting nothing, son. Pick a card, any card. Do 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 do. Pa 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 pa. 
dead. Oh, you can use SP. Everybody, hold up. Get one, <laughs> one SP. Probably get them to 44. Oh, definitely. One more, one more level. V4 Zorn. Get that extra like 10, 15 HP. That'll make the difference. Pick a card. Any card. Can't do shit. Can't do shit. Galactic Bang. Lightning and Thunder. Come to me. But can you find information about the Pence Libro, dude? What if the snake had dialed? What if the snake was actually like a guardian and there was a fifth guardian? And, uh, and now there isn't. That'd be cool. But again, like, <laughs> like Rock said, that'd be way too interesting. Though I remember them saying things like, uh, if the Grandia wanted to remaster sells pretty good like oh yeah we'll make more uh, like you know PR talk uh, but I hope that if it does come around for them to make like this game again in, in HD in question in quotation marks uh, that they add subtitles to the cutscenes like I just want the subtitles that's all I ask it's not a lot it might be a lot uh, oop, I think I took the wrong turn but we can fix this. We can just cut through here. I think that's the Minotaur. That's the Minotaur that spawns like three rabbits, uh, which I can't take on because I don't have my orb. Is this the one that has like four Minotaurs? Oh shit, that's the one of three rabbits. Or maybe they both have them. Yep, see ya. Oh, absolutely not. Even if I beat the Minotaur by itself, that's like 2000 XP, so it's fine. Grau. Is that the snake's name? All the oh, Grouse, the, the teacher. Just one paragraph? Let's see. Final card seals your fate. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, Yuki doesn't fight him at all, but he's seen in various cutscenes. Uh, stabs him in the back, we saw that, and then he proceeds to die. Yep. That's all there is. Special level eight, god damn it. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh shit, that's not in a circle. Whoops. That's so funny. It's just like exactly the same thing I had, like just the the background you get from like an NPC in Ankrad. And then literally the cutscene that just happened. That's it. Oh divine comet. Slice through the pitch black night. Why is he faster than me? That's bullshit. Boink, 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 boink. I'll just auto him to death. Oh, 
Nice combo. Okay, did I never give Yuki like his the extra combo ability, or am I just not seeing it? No, yeah, increases combo attack hits. God damn it! Nice whiff. Stop with the attack. I want to cancel. You need the SP. I want you for the boss fight. Stop. God damn it. Oh, it's crazy. Never mind. That's fine. But still, stop it. Is it even worth it to have and skate him? Yeah, it is. I forgot that Ulf doesn't have resistance because he has the SP up. <laughs> Amulet, whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. That's on me. Don't do it, Ulf. Don't do it, man. Whatever it is. Whatever it is you're doing, don't. That's up. Not worth it. Combo. But he only gets like one extra hit. Ulf gets like eight extra hits. What's the difference? This will be more than a little frostbite. Ooh, that happens game was not not worth it. That's fine. That's fine. We can recover. There's more. There's more MP where that came from. <laughs> Don't do it, Ulf. Eat my tail. The fates have smiled on us today. Do, 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 do. Uh, oh shit, I think that's it for like... There's no more enemies. On the other side, there's like those demons and uh... Really fast Omega dude, I don't want to fight that. Oh, it's rabbits. The Minotaur is perfect. Perish. Ah, uh, that's the three Minotaur fight. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That's problematic. Buster Horn, Buster Horn dynamic dawn. Oh my god, nice start. <laughs> Actually, I could have defended against that. Oh, huh, that was close. Oh, divine tonic. Slice through the pitch black night. What's next? Something. Let's we'll hang out. Re-evaluate, see what's fresh, see what's kicking. Nice, nothing. Buster horn. Something. Something. Oh, goodbye, Donna. How could this happen? Uh, Wolf's fine. He might get confused, though. Yep. Lightning and thunder, come to me. I even had the advantage. What would have happened if I had like a back attack? It's even worth it. I have to revive two people. So There's still three of them. Nah, it's not worth it. Did we make it? What about this guy? They can't both be bullshit fights. Oh, okay, that's better. That's better. And I can't help at all. <laughs> 
Oh, they're both attacking Alfina. Oh, really? We'll just hang out. Flame Spike is just garbage good. Ah, uh, it's Flash. Maybe Berserker stacks. If I give Yuki like two Berserkers, I wonder if he gets like double, 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 you know. Perfect. Leave this to me. How slash lol. <laughs> so Yuki with flash on does as many combos as Ulf does regularly. That's just Am I back at the entrance? Oh my god. I think I have enemies to fight. Might have to go back one map. Uh, I don't think there was anything here. No. There's a rabbit on the other side, but again, I can't really take him on. They're too fast. I don't want to burn the orb. This is the longest thing about grinding, is just getting the orb back up. It takes so goddamn long. I don't know if it depends on like the number of enemies you fight or just the number of battles you have, but either way, it's bullshit. It is really strong though, so I guess it makes sense. Mm, I will eat it this time. That was really strong, actually. I'm impressed. Also, don't remember what Elfina's doing now. Oh, God, I think bang, I'm right. Whoops. Well, on the bright side, it's dead. Oh, the orb is full! The orb is full! We can go! We can leave! We can be free! There's no kill like overkill. Hey, if it's worth doing, it's worth overdoing. Oh, a minotaur respawn. Super. I'll sneak by. Don't mind me. Oh, so the regular enemies respawn, but not the rabbits, that's weird. Yep, don't mind me, coming through, beep beep. We're heading to the end boss, it's time. It's time to see if I can actually nuke it. The thing with the... oh shit. Actually, I'll do that at the save point. Um... He's really fast, like he's super fast on the AP bar, and he has an attack that... It's like his standard attack is a uh, splash damage, just like Emilius's was. So I have to like separate all my people. And I just remembered the oh back attack. I need to give literally anybody the ability that they can't be knocked back on the IP bar. Probably Donna. Actually, maybe Alfina because she's the healer. What's that guy doing, Dark Mist? Pick a card. Any card. 
Eh, dock. Goodbye, everybody. Ha, that worked. Oh, no. Ha, nice one. The boss fights that have multiple parts I find are easier, just because they get easier as you break away parts and stuff like that. So the end boss just being like one unit is like, eh, it doesn't get easier. And I don't know if he gets harder even, like if he has a, like a face change halfway through where he just like gets more abilities. I know Death Canal sucks, although you just have to move out, away from it, but it still sucks. Actually, I'll save after the setup. Setup skills. Do I have the thingy? Where you? Strengths this cancel effect. Increases combo damage. Ah, unshakable will. That's the one. It's not delayed one hit. Give that to Alfina. I have a lot of magic points and like no magic to give. So uh, we'll just leave it. And then Ulf gets back his... Prevent status disorders. And we'll chug some SP potions. We cannot chug some SP potions. Those are battle exclusive, I guess. That sucks. Oh, actually, wait, then I can just eat a nut for the, like, permanent increase. Yeah, 130. I'm just doing that so she has Armageddon so we can slow down the big bad man. Get that, and Ulf is fine, he has 100. All right, this is my favorite part. Watch this. Look, look, watch how close he is, right? He's like right there. So we're walking towards him, and he's way the fuck back there. The Hall of Nothingness. That's it, everybody. The final area of the game. Wait, where the fuck? Is that the... That's some, that's some Final Fantasy bullshit. Look at the sword. Zord! We will defeat you! So in between cutscenes when Amelia sacrificed himself, he gained like another eyeball. I'm pretty sure it only had one earlier. Yeah, that. That attack's gonna happen the entire fight. <laughs> so we're gonna... Wolf moves. Yuki moves. Gonna win. That's the one. Guess over there. Alrighty. Mana spring. Oh, that's so slow. Uh, wow. Oh, barely out of range. Oh, that sucks. Dig it. Dark him. Ah, uh, that's, a, that's a defend. That still hurts a lot. Attack power up. Oh, maybe instead of digging with Alfina, I probably should have used Armageddon first just to slow him the hell down. Guy's too fast. Protection. 
Like, look at look at him go. Look at him go around the map. It still attacks three of them. Yuki's in trouble. Let's dark him again. Yeet. Wait, 128,000. Alright, strap in, lads. Oh, goodbye, Alvina. That was fast. That was a record kill. This final card seals your fate. Dark him on off. Uh, he'll survive. He hasn't taken much damage. Uh, so we're fit to use the orb already, just to get ahead. No. We have no choice. Please work. Tanking it all, just tanking it. Let your anger and your hate. Thank you, Hecht, for the Armageddon spell. Very nice, very nice. Speed down, that's the one. That's the big one. So if attack up and defense down, how much does it do? Almost 4k, nice. Just a, a many more of those, please. Just for the sake of Yuki surviving, I'm gonna throw a uh, healing gem instead of attacking. Why don't we try this? I could have sworn that I could actually like surround him. But maybe not. Stop. Uh, what do I have? Galactic Bang. All healer? Oh, runner, right, I forgot. Runner makes you go faster. It's like, it's a haste, basically. Oh shit, is he fast again? Damn, that wore off really quick. Speed up. Get some haste. Oh, dark him. That's not gonna kill her, but it won't be pretty. Mm, I don't think I have anything to prevent it either. Oh, but I do have the big bombs. And platinum feather. Platinum feather. Let's see if it actually does something. Cause it's either gonna it's gonna put me on the bar, I hope, then Alfina can defend. Oh baby. Uh no, Alfina will defend. So we'll leave that. We'll use the 
big one. 3,000. Guard. Flame spike. Flame spike. really slow. It should do more damage than his actual attack though. Oh yeah. Let's do that for a hot second. Was it Alfina? Okay. I wonder how much I can knock off with the orb on. It's like three full turns. So that's 4,000 flame spike times three is 12. I don't know how much the gates are. Oh, I might get cocky, but I'm in a really good position now just to like hammer it out. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm in a good place. Instead of, you know, having a couple people dead later on and then having be like, okay, do I need to heal or do I need to freeze time and just take the freeze time to revive? And... Oh, did Ulf dodge and counter? That's awesome. That's all completely free still. Then we'll use Runner on Dana so Dana can get that out faster. Maybe Donna needs an attack up also. Ooh, 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 ooh. I don't know how much that actually does in total, but I hope it's a lot. I think it's worth it right now. Blade Storm. Blade Storm. Oh, let's, just, let's use the last couple bombs that I still have. The big one. It's not that much faster, but it is still an improvement. This final card seals your fate. Oh, Office thirty three. I don't have enough for Shadow Warrior, so let's do that first. Can't tell which one is me. <laughs> Keep an eye on my shadow. I grant you the speed of light. It should actually wear off pretty soon, so I'm gonna all heal her with Alfina next. And then dig in with Yuki. Oh, that wore off too. I don't think I'm gonna get him to half before it wears off, but it'll be close. If he uses erosion, that's good, because I'm resistant to everything. So I hope he uses erosion. I don't understand why that doesn't just combo up. There we go. 82,000. Yeah, I guess I'll just keep going. No need for strategy. Just 
just violence. Sometimes violence is necessary. Okay, so he's like s at 66, give or take. Oops, that wore off. Is Ulf actually getting? Oh yeah, he is. Slowly, but he is. Oh, he's moving again. He's moving. Uh, okay, Bond. Get Alfina going. And then we're gonna aim again. Uh, if Yuki can uh, give her a uh, potion. That'd be fantastic. Ah, Death Canal, there it is. It puts an AoE on the floor. And uh, you, be <laughs> you gotta, gotta move. Gotta move. Uh, oh, that's right outside, right? Yeah, it looks right. Oof. Scoot. Scoot, my dude. That's like... Oh, yeah, actually, that looks way better over here. Scoot. And Alfina. That's still inside the circle. That's inside the circle. I don't want to punch them up, but I guess I have to. Okay, Yuki, you give Alfina the... Warrior's Tonic. Wolf, you stand right where you are, because if I combo, he's probably just gonna like move back into the death circle. And that's problematic. Uh, defense, are you ready for Armageddon? We're approaching the 50%. I didn't have a stopwatch to know how long this battle is, but some people uh, on the internet forums were saying like half an hour. I believe. All oh, right, Alfina has. She won't get knocked back. Despair. Oh, is that instant death? Oh no, that just got rid of his status boosts. Okay, sure. Let your anger and your hate be absorbed by the divine light. Your suffering is over. Uh the stay removes all the status boosts that someone it's a really long animation for a buff cleanser, right? Alright, uh, despair removes the stat boost and prevents new ones from coming on. Oh, okay. So, uh, no, no digging for Ulf, I guess. Ha, <laughs> see a death now. That's a really long wind up, too. Like, that's like, that was a couple turns in between. It won't work for me, but it'll work for the other two. And, uh, is it worth it? Yeah. So Heaven's Gate will be stronger. And whatever the hell Yuki's doing. I still don't know what to do with him. This is <laughs> the most useless he's been in any playthrough I've had, which is not many. Maybe two or three front to back, but like, he's never been this shit. I don't know what I did wrong with him. I nah, don't even bother healing, just uh, pop a gem. There you go. This should work.
Don't even bother, Yuki. Wait, if he's attacking Ulf and Alfina gets told to defend, it might be Thunderclap. And Thunderclap is... Oh, it's Darkness. Maybe he does have new attacks after the 50% mark. I should have waited to use my orb. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Okay, not awful. Not great, but not awful. Giving Alfina the uh, no knockback has been a boon. Leave this to me. I don't know what it is. It might just be an auto attack. What's oh, despair? Another buff cleanser on my previously existing buff cleanser. But yeah, again, out of all three Grandia, well, four, but let's not count extreme. Out of all three mainline Grandia games, this is the hardest end boss. Which says something about how easy one and two are, if more than anything else. God damn it. Just as I was about to use Diggin, that was gonna hurt a little bit more. Just a little bit, though. As long as Yuki doesn't get cancelled. Perfect. Darkness. This you. Darkness consume you. Uh... to recover defense seed I probably should heal but I'm a, a taste of blood and I want to slow down slow down son be absorbed by the divine light your suffering is over your suffering is over <laughs> boom Let's blow the hell out of him Speed down. Speed down important. Ooh. Wolf again, right? That guy's just Oh, that's a that's a suplex, right? He's so beefy though, he might live. Even though he's at like half health. Look at that. Ooh, uh, ooh, uh, ooh, uh, ooh. Uh. <laughs> yeah, boom. That's such a good attack. Uh, I don't know if Yuki's gonna get there in time, so, uh, Dana, Dana heal. Why don't we try this? I'm pretty sure all healer plus exists and I just don't have it. And we'll give, uh, not... Uh, nut. Oops. Power nut. Power nut. This should work. Wait, why is it power nut and then it's power seed? I'm confused. Love will destroy the world. I think erosion is the one that applies all status effects, or like some random selection, but still. We gotta get more points. We gotta get... I have so many of these nuts. Ooh, makes her faster on the bar. Um, yes, this is it. Yeah, there's no post game or anything, so I can just use all my mega elixirs. He's just kind of hanging out on the bar. Okay. Flame Psych. Oh, that's Thunderclap. I like how he just parks on like the calm, just 
weights. Yeah. Oh, he's red. He's red. We're at 50k. From we started at 120. We're at 50. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a this is a fight. That's a that's a marathon. Some people were also saying like, oh, uh, remember the the crystal boss that I was stuck at for a little while there? People were like, oh, you should be in like the late 30s, early 40s for that boss fight. <laughs> well, I think when when I loaded the stream, I was 37. <laughs> so it's like I'm so behind in levels. Oh shit, that kills her instantly. Well, that's not good. It's a good thing Yuki's right there. Restores 99. Oh, damn. Oh yeah, the maximum level is 99, which of course, of course it is. Uh, I don't know how to get there though, except for with just a hundred hours of grinding against the rabbits. Because some of the monsters just give like two, three hundred. The minotaurs give what one, two thousand. This kills the elf girl instantly, and now she's mad. She's back and she's pissed. Just have to keep up the speed down. Oh, death now, cute. It's always cool when there's only like one person standing there. I hope it's just Ulf. <gasps> it might actually just be Ulf. Oh, hey, sucker. I only have to move one person. Eat shit, douchebag. Yuki, can it be your turn again, please? I need digging up, like, yesterday. Hope you're not sick of Heaven's Gate yet, because we have a lot more Heaven's Gates to go through before this guy dies. Also, I can't believe I beat the game without Dragon Cut. That's so funny. Is Yuki's most powerful ability? No. No, I'm cool. Oh, hey, speaking of Yuki... Take time. I like he's just become like my buffer. <laughs> I should have given him runner too, so Alfina doesn't have to. Oh, Ulf again. That's a problem. Also the debuffs don't really last that long. You know Armor again is really good. Because he just has like some resist Ulf! Ulf, why did you move? Kind of weird how the main character has been neg I mean, if he wasn't shit, I wouldn't have have. I wouldn't have to do that. Dimension gate on Yuki. Dimension gate on Yuki will kill him. But let's get Ulf up first. Don't worry, I still have my trump card. Uh, well, with digging on. He might live, but barely. Oh, that's really fast too. Oh, I can cancel him! Yugi will not die. Not today, son. No, he's gonna do something worse, watch. Oh, no, never mind. Yeah, I should have given Yuki like everything, like dig and runner, wow, and just like have him in the back row and just buff everybody. <laughs> just in case the old ghost hits up though. Uh, I'll do that. Wolf. I don't know what he's doing. I'm just gonna defend. I'm scared. 
I'm scared it's gonna be something stupid. Wait, did Ulf not just revive? Oh, right, because of despair. That got rid of everything. That's bullshit. I even used like, that specific healing potion that buffs everything and he just negates it. Oh, that's better than taking damage, I guess. Like this. You can't get away with the. You can't keep getting away with this! Leave this to me. And we're full, baby! Dimension gate. Ooh, it's blocking time. I don't know what I took away from Donna that she doesn't have the MP recovery with Defend anymore, but I took something away. A suplex Donna. I just imagine, like, how do you defend against that? You just put your arms out and you're just like, oh, flex. Actually, no, I, w I guess you would relax your muscles. Uh, this will hurt, but it's fine. <laughs> Whoa! Alright, Yuki, it's your time to shine. Spirit seed. This should work. I should have given Yuki the ability to where <laughs> he can use items faster. <laughs> My uh, support build, Yuki. It's the uh, the new meta. Once upon a time, I had a phone. Oh, it's over there. So he's just gonna attack Yuki, that's fine with me. It's time for Armageddon? I think it's time for Armageddon. Just have to chug a hero thingy. Oh, Warrior's Tonic, never mind. Shwoop. Oh no, don't be on Alfina. Damn it! That skills the elf. Yep. Insta death. I just don't think I have those potions anymore where like you instantly go on the IP bar. No, but I have to hear his elixir. Let's use that. This will get you back on your feet. This will get you back on your feet. It's okay. I'll be fine. Perfect. Speed up and everything. Stop dying, Ulf. Start not dying. Dark him on Elfina. Again, won't kill her, but will hurt. Uh, I'm okay with that. Not much I can do anyway. Did that knock her back on the bar? She's not supposed to. She's supposed to stay in place. And keep moving, because that's the ability that costs you 3 points. I feel like I'm falling a little bit behind in damage. Oh, darkness, perfect. I think everybody has dig in except for Ulf, but Ulf also has like double the HP, so it's fine. 
Did she just die from full? Oh no, wait, she got lasered. I was like, that's bullshit. Oh shit, he's turning it around on me. Oh fuck. Oh, Dana's also pretty fucking dead. This is problematic. Please start doing auto attacks again. Oh no. This is Problem City. We have no choice. Please. Uh oh. I just need to get out an Armageddon! Ooh, darkness again. Okay, let's defend against that. Yuki's not gonna have a good time, but... He'll live. He'll live, barely, but he'll live. Do I need to get... Heal up, and then get Dana back. Oh, 198, nice. Come on, Ulf! Race, my boy! Race, 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 race. Oh, three. that's even better. Time to recover. Okay, if he doesn't lightning speed go across calm, I can cancel whatever's happening with Alfina. Erosion. Never mind, I will not cancel anything. Armageddon time. <gasps> and it's free! It's free and it's stronger. Fuck. Yes, super duper. Actually, I don't even need to live with the full party at the end, because there's no experience points anyway. Unless there's experience points at the end, which doesn't do anything because the game's over and there's no post-game. It's not like a Bravely where you can like save and then it just puts you back in like the previous save point. Which would be cool, but that's not the case. I'm pretty sure Bravely does that. Oh yeah, definitely does. The misery. Your misery, your suffering, your hatred. We have no choice. That means I can do one more arm again for free. Probably should have defended with Yuki just to like see what's happening. Oh, nope, this is fine. I can live with that. Come on, race, 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 race. A cancel? I'll do it. That didn't do anything, game. You shit, lord. You fucker, you tricked me. Sucks. I trusted the game on that decision. Please don't kill my buffer. I need him. Thank you for not killing my buffer. I need him. This final card seals your fate. Yeah, if I had gone in with like level 37 and not what am I 40? Or I probably would have died uh, to that attack and many others, just based on like defense and HP pools. Oh, he's back to being really, really fast. That's problematic. Hey Yuki, don't die, please. Hey Yuki, how about some digging? Time to recover. I want a defense up. How cute would that be? Oh, please be fast. Question marks. It could be darkness. Could be anything. Just like that, you're dead. Perfect. Another one of those, please. Thank you. Very nice. Oh, god damn it, this kills Alfina. Must 
It's like he knows I'm gonna Armageddon immediately when it's her turn. He's like, no, I can't be slow, I'll die. <gasps> Holy shit, she lived, but she got knocked back all the way on the bar. Uh, can't attack this turn. Why don't we try this? Stop, I have to attack. I have to do damage or I'll never finish this fight. Oh, something on Yuki. Okay. Oh, knees, yes, knees. Alrighty. I think... I think I'm in a good place right now. Yugi is defending, he's fine. Alfina can Armageddon. Katana can attack. Wolf can heal, I guess. Heal Yuki so it doesn't perish immediately. Maybe Yuki can heal himself. Because with Armageddon, I think I can make it in time. Oh yeah, I can make it in time. Please don't kill Alfina, I swear to god. Swear to god. I'm also running out of uh, <laughs> reviving potions. I don't know if I have like two or three left. But like if Dana and Alfina keep biting the dust. Well, I mean, they both have the resurrection spell, but uh, there's another turn. Perfect. Flame Psych. Yeah. Absolutely not. So he's at what, 9,000? 8,900. Okay, one more big heal. Uh, quick math. This is fine. May the fates hear my call for healing. Actually, with his like continuous auto attacks, if I had given Donna like her card counter spell, I could have done like a little bit more damage here and there. Darkness is a big AoE, so no thank you. I definitely could have cancelled that, just kidding, lol. Soon, this world will be mine. I kinda got trigger happy with the defend. <laughs> But, this is fine. Okay, 8,000. Let's heal first. Flame spike. Leave this to me. Yuki is not going to do anything on his turn, we're just going to defend with Yuki. Just so I have a... Yeah, for that, exactly. Oh no, wait, you can cancel it? Nice. Oh yeah, now he's charging it up. Okay, perfect. Actually, that's decent enough damage. That's not terrible. Despair. That'll teach ya to... Shit. This <laughs> this pair. Fat Moge bomb. You know the Moge from Grandia One. Let me try my secret weapon. Ha! Which are totally not in this game. Okay, I wasn't that wasn't that great. I was expecting a little bit more. Ooh, ooh, this might be the kill shot. Heaven's Gate. This better be the kill shot. Uh, would be cool if it was Armageddon, but... <laughs> my secret weapon! This final 
All right, I'm putting a controller down. We should be good. That was like at least, yeah, tw at least 20 minute long fight. Oh, barely killed him. Like the last couple hits did him in. We did it! He's dead! Alfina! Oh, that's the Sora Kingdom Hearts run. You also need those goofy shoes. that he died protecting you that was kind of underwhelming oh don't worry The Grandia 2 final boss is underwhelming. This was fun, by comparison. Same with Grandia 1 though. The Grandia 1 final boss was also really disappointing. And that's it. He died protecting you. Who says that to someone? <laughs> to Afina, he's dead. You gotta let go. Yeah, yeah, he just charged right in and got himself killed. Idiot. Uh, but yeah, the Grandia 1 final boss had two phases, both of which were boring. Uh, but the dungeon was cool, yeah. And the boss fight before... Like the perfect form, you know who. That fight was really fun. And more challenging. Oh, that's music. I wanna. I'm gonna mute the stream because I already have two copyright strikes <laughs> from using the song in like the previous parts. But yeah. Uh, the Grandia 2 final boss, too. Like the leading up to it is really fun. And then you get to the boss and it's just like, oh, that's it. Because you can you can stun lock the boss in Grandia too, so he never actually gets a turn in, and then you just crush him into dust with a flying Tenseiken. It's so fun though. 
<laughs> one of your characters gets an ability, just like Alfina's um, stun force. It's the same thing. And you just, but he is able to be stun locked. <laughs> <laughs> and he just like lays there the entire time while you're wailing on him. And if he ever gets up, you just stun lock him again. And then he's like, uh, just like Zord. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> it's so good. You don't even need skills. You can just like cobble him to death. Some people were saying like, oh, it's like symbolism because uh, the final boss is like the perfect being, right? Just like Zorn, basically. Uh, but then when you fight him, it's like this like fucking push over, and it's like, oh, it wasn't such a perfect form after all. It's like symbolic or whatever. And it's like, fuck, I don't care. I want a fun final boss. Not some fucking little shit butterfly dude. Handsome? Aaron Handsome wrote this song? He wrote the words and music? Wait, Japanese lyrics, but it's English. It's been translated. Oh, they have offspring. There's a little. Oh no, I don't want to see you like this, Yuki. With the arms out. Well, that's... at least it didn't have like triplets and twins like. Justin and Fina. Hey, Daddy, can I fly too? Absolutely not. Oh no. I don't want another copyright strike. Don't do it. <laughs> Can I fly too? No. Crash? Yes. You gotta crash at least 20 planes before you're allowed to fly. <laughs> that doesn't answer the question. <laughs> I'm hoping this part is at least fine. I can always mute it again later. But that's it. That's Grand Year 3. It's over. We did it, Reddit. I can now not play it again. Man. That wasn't, that wasn't underwhelming, but it was just like a regular amount of whelming. Definitely doesn't hold a candle to one or two. Still better than extreme. Da, 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 da. Oh, I was just took the discount <laughs> just out of reflex. <laughs> the middle of the credits, just no more discount. Disc back in the case, case back on the shelf. But yeah, Bravely coming out on Friday. There's gonna be no streams for a little while. So I don't think I wanna play uh, my next game alongside with Bravely. Parallel Trippers next. Again, I'll play Parallel Trippers before I, <laughs> before I play Extreme. <laughs> That's not a problem. That's the problem with Parallel Trippers being based based Game Boy game is the real issue. The battle system is really slow and there's like again this the cast of playable characters is like 30 or 40 it's stupid big like every character or every other character from Grandia 1 joins your party wait you fatable what no what what you fatable they did the storyboards for this? How do you fuck this up? This was, I guess, before... Uh, no, this was before their breakout hit, a phase zero, that got them all the money.
Actually, I don't know the history of that studio. Cutting direction wasn't that bad. Yeah, that's true, that's true. They they worked with what they had. Production IG, yeah, yeah, yeah. And backed by the big Square Enix. In the year, was it again 2006? Yeah. Wait, on the back of the box it even says, team up with your allies to execute stunning aerial combo attacks like it's a feature of the game. Well, like, I guess it's fine, but it's not like a back of the box blurb kind of thing. Experience detailed graphics and CG cinemas, which bring the story to life. I don't know why, but when the back of the box where the screenshots are like as big as my thumb, it looks really crisp. Also, it's locked to 4x... Wait, what am I playing it on? It's not 3x4, is it? Oh, totally is. When do you ever really get to do aerial combos, So Yeah, like, with Crackle. Oh yeah, when you shoot an enemy up with Crackle, or when you get, like, just the combos, or the criticals, right, so you can launch an enemy up. It's, like, the only time, but... It's... Okay... But it's not like a ha ha ha. Unleash what is this? <laughs> Unleash the ultimate action battle system with devastating attacks and magic. That's true. I can vouch for the battle system. Battle system is the most fun in the series. Although I, I kind of miss the fact that's what I'm gonna do with Grandia too. It's like that you can't like stack Diggin up to five times.